To announce the recipient of the 2022 Franz Edelman Award, it's now my great pleasure to bring back to the podium the president of Informs, Radhika Kalkarni. You know, I thought I'd be the one that got to say, hand me the envelope, but it's not going to be so. Uh, and accompanying Radhika with the envelope containing the name of the first place team is Carrie Beam, chair of the Edelman Prize Committee. Thank you, Erica. It is such a privilege to be here this evening as we celebrate the outstanding accomplishments of all the Edelman finalists. It truly is the Nobel Prize of OR and analytics. And now, the moment of truth. Carrie, may I have the judge's decision, please? Thank you. Wow. The winner is Gabierno de Chile. <laughs> And to accept the award and say a few words on behalf of Chile, please welcome Paula Daza from the Ministry of Health. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I don't have words in this moment. Um, I want to thank INFORMS I want to thank for the judges of Edelman Awards. Uh, we already were very, very happy. We were very uh, congratulated because we were here, because we were selected as the finalist of the five Edelman Awards. But being winning here, uh, it's really very, very important for us. Uh, this is our great group. I want to thank you in the name of the University of Chile, EC, uh, also the Ministry of Science and the Ministry of Health. But I want to thank you in the name of all my country. This is the work of many, many people who are not here that we represent as a country. I think one of the most important things that we learned in the last two years that was working in a collaborative way, and even being people different, coming from different pathways, but working together with a just one main object that was to contain the pandemic. We wanted to save lives. We wanted to save our country. We wanted to minimize the people who were into the ICU and the people who were dying. Is that wise? Because today we are from the government, from the universities, from the civil society, from the private sector, working together, we collaborating together, we could 
might contain this terrible pandemic that attacked the whole world. We hope that what we have learned in the last two years in our country and in the whole world will teach us that working together is the main important thing to have in the future to diminish the dying people and always the illness. Thank you very much.